Karmic relationships no longer hold a place in your person's life. Their heart is throbbing with unbearable pain as the attachments tied to these karmic situations slowly wither away. They're feeling drained by the energies associated with karmic individuals. And they've reached a point where they simply don't have the strength to deal with any disturbances linked to these relationships. Currently, they're in a phase of deep introspection and self-reflection. This introspective period is crucial for your person as it enables them to address unresolved issues and areas in need of healing. Mental clarity is returning. Their inner feminine essence is resurging and emotional distress is gradually subsiding, allowing pent-up emotions to resurface and be released. They're finally able to view things from different perspectives. Your person is now taking action based on the lessons learned from their recent experiences in karmic situations. They're opening their mind and heart, embracing reality, and expanding their awareness, self-realization, and healing. They regard their relationship with you as both their most significant challenge and their ultimate source of joy. They're coming to terms with how immature and thoughtless they were in their interactions with you, and their silence reflects their commitment to working on themselves. They understand that you deserve a higher level of commitment from them, and the best part is that they genuinely want to give it to you. They're willing to make the effort to nurture this connection because being apart from you has been exceptionally difficult they believe that the time is approaching when they can reap the rewards of the hard work and challenges both of you have faced on this shared journey. To them, you embody the qualities of an ideal life partner. Right now, you're completely inaccessible. Your focus is entirely on yourself, dedicated to building your financial stability and advancing your career. The need for attention and recognition no longer entices you. Instead, you prefer to operate quietly, keeping your thoughts and feelings to yourself. This quality is incredibly appealing to your partner, who longs for your warmth, a connection that has been absent for quite some time. Although there's a strong desire for a sensual and energetic reconnection, External circumstances are preventing it to ensure you both don't fall into old patterns of chasing and running, which you emerged from after overcoming numerous challenges. Your partner anxiously awaits any signs that you still want them back, deeply moved by your honesty and kindness. They're willing to do whatever it takes, endure any hardship, just to be with you as they cannot envision you with anyone else. In their eyes, you're the only one they've ever truly desired or needed as a life partner, because no one else can comprehend them or connect with them as you can. Your self-love and self-respect are intensely attractive to your partner, who views you as a mature and genuine individual. You captivate their attention like no one else, and they want to approach you without reservations, feeling irritated by the phoniness and deceitfulness of others around them. They yearn for stability and a long-lasting commitment with you, valuing privacy and establishing boundaries with others to ensure they can reach you. They're making significant sacrifices to draw closer to you, holding you in high esteem and admiring your courage. Presently, my life is incredibly stressful. I've been engaged in conflicts with the people around me because I'm determined to assert my true self and stand my ground. This journey has been arduous as I work on healing aspects of myself that have hindered my personal growth. I'm in the process of formulating new aspirations for my life and strategizing how to achieve them. 
It's a solitary path, but solitude is necessary for my personal development and self-discovery. I acknowledge that I haven't kept you fully informed about the changes happening in my life. But please understand that everything is unfolding as per a divine plan. We both recognize the need for solitude and the imperative to work diligently on ourselves, dismantling any barriers that keep us apart and confronting the fears we've accumulated throughout our lives. There's ancestral karma that requires healing, and we must tap into the power of unconditional love. The more I disconnect from the external world, the closer I feel to the unconditional love I hold for you. My emotions have been overwhelming lately, scattered in all directions, and I'm striving to find balance. I can't seem to forget you, and I've come to realize that it's because of the profound soul connection and emotional attachment we share. I'm beginning to open up to this concept, and I've even researched these terms to better understand why I'm irresistibly drawn to you, no matter how far I attempt to distance myself. My Divine Feminine, why do you doubt the depth of my love for you? I comprehend that you're weary of feeling drained and in pain. I share in that weariness, but it doesn't diminish my love for you. I sense your presence near me, and my love for you surpasses that for anyone else. I'm no longer the same toxic and manipulative man you first encountered. Your love has fundamentally transformed my entire being. The inner turmoil and resistance I once harbored have subsided into a sense of peace. I'm shedding the sadness and anxiety because I no longer wish to feel lifeless inside. I'm determined not to repeat the same mistakes that have cost me so much, including you, my love. For a long time, my unhappiness and negativity served as distractions preventing me from confronting myself. It was easier to align with others' misery, as it allowed me to shirk responsibility for my own feelings. I could conveniently blame others for my actions and blend in with the negativity that surrounded me. However, it was you who opened my eyes to the truth. Through our connection, I learned and experienced something profoundly enlightening the concept of karma, where what goes around comes around. I began witnessing the heartbreak and pain resulting from the wrongs I had committed. The more I tried to operate from my ego self, the more internal pain I felt. My life began to crumble, and I see you as a divine, special catalyst. Many things I once considered unreal became tangible and vivid through our journey together. This connection has imparted invaluable life lessons that no one else has ever taught me. You've shown me the true worth of genuine relationships, how to love unconditionally, how to stand strong and resolute in the face of challenges and chaos, and how to exhibit fairness and kindness even when luck is not on our side. The saying that only a truly courageous woman has the power to change and transform a wounded man, and vice versa, perfectly applies to you. You not only made me recognize my mistakes, but also guided me and illuminated the path to make them right. Thank you, my warrior.